Hi, welcome back. Um, we're now going to look at getting the ball to follow the mouse in level one. Um, before we do that, let's just test where we're up to. There we go. When I click the green flag, everything disappears apart from the play button. When I click the play button, one second, two second, and there we go. My sprites appear, my background switches. So, what we're going to do with this ball, make sure I've got it selected first, is to get it to follow the mouse. Um, I'm going to add on to this script here. So, forever, point towards mouse pointer, and move, start with five steps, if you want it to move faster you can always change that later on. Um, so, test again, play, one, two, off we go. Bit easy this, isn't it? I can go straight through the walls at the moment. So, we're going to get it to stop going straight through the walls. There are a couple of options here for gameplay. Um, so, if touching colour, sorry, I want sensing, touching colour, and my walls are green, so let's try and click on them. There we go. If touching colour green, we can either get it to do this, which is move, I'm going to put minus six because I'm moving forward five so let's try that again we've got to work our way through this bit there we go so now it will bump off the walls but that's too easy because I can just bash into all the walls and carry on to the portal so instead of that I'm going to put I'm just going to duplicate pull this out and duplicate it go to there we go so now what should happen is if I touch a green wall, bang, I'm back at the start. Oh, there we go. Getting a lot of email today, but there we go. I can now, it makes the game trickier because every time I touch the wall, I'm back at the start. Um, and one final thing, if it's touching the portal, I want it to broadcast level two intro so that we can then hide it and start all the sprites appearing and disappearing for level 2. So if touching, not touching colour this time, if touching level 1 portal, broadcast, and I want a new one, level 2 intro this time, and I'm going to get it to hide because I don't want the ball after level 1 is finished. There we go. So that's how to get the ball moving. Um, next video we're going to look at this level 2 intro broadcast and get everything to show and hide depending on that.